Bonnie, happy Thursday. I am back. Oh my goodness, you guys. We have got to talk about the Bath and Body Works 1295 candle sale today. Yes, this is a good deal. It's even a better deal if you have the 25% off coupon from the Tropidelic coupon book. Mine was actually loaded onto my app wallet. So I'm actually going to save my coupon um, because I want to save that for the next uh, round, the spring three that's coming. But if you wanted to stock up on candles today and you use that 25% off coupon, you were going to pay candle day prices, $9.71 with that 25% off. So that's like Best deal, I think, um, so far this year. We might have had one other sale, but this is kind of a big one um, for the rest of like the tropical and the spring candles. And we have two new limited edition candles, which I did order. So I did something a little bit different today. Um, I thought about going to the store, but I'm like, I don't know if they're going to be in the store. And I didn't know what my schedule was today. So I log in and I had one of those 15% off pop-ups. And I'm like, oh, okay, 15% off. So let me do the math. 12.95 um, minus 15%. I got them for $11 each. So we're going to talk about the new limited edition. I actually did not even use the 50% uh, off because I used the 15 instead. So I could have gotten uh, free shipping on 50 with the code so bright. I didn't even spend 50. I got two candles and I got a free wallflower plug-in. I got the, the Cheers beer mug. <laughs> I don't know why. I wanted to review that for you guys. I thought it was kind of a cute collectible and it was free. So I got it. So I got that. And then I got number 33 limited edition. So there's two new limited edition candles at Bath and Body Works today. Um, number 33 smells like um, early morning pick-me-up with a bright, cheerful twist. It's espresso beans, warm vanilla, and lemon peel. I'm like, that's a really odd combination. I got it. I got to see what this one is. The other one is number 42. So there's two different numbers, 33 and 42. This one is like sipping a warm beverage while exploring your favorite used bookstore. It better not be a uh, book club. <laughs> Like, no. <laughs> so this one is sweet cream, fresh cinnamon, and vintage leather. I'm hoping I like this one better than I liked Bookloft because you and me, you know me, Bookloft and I were not getting along. So Bath and Body Works, like I said today, we're gonna go over some of my hits and misses for the candle sale. Um 85 plus fragrances, and then we now have the um, Name Them Now Brag Forever. So now they're having us vote on the two mystery candles. So here's, I'm like, okay, we can vote on these. Um, so vote for candle number 33. Afrogato and Lemon Peel, Lemon Espresso Twist, Morning Spring Coffee, and Springtime Latte. Well, you know what? I really shouldn't do this without smelling them, but I'm going to. I'm going to do Lemon Espresso Twist based on the scent notes. I'm doing it. Okay, the next one is Vintage Vinyl and Sweet Cream, Sweet Vanilla Vetiver. I'm like, I hope it's not Vetiver. Vintage Memories and Vanilla Musk and Leather. I'm going with Vintage Vinyl and Sweet Cream just because I like the name. Seriously. Okay, it says, stay tuned. We'll reveal the winners right here in just a week. <laughs> okay, so that's kind of interesting. I'm like, there's a lot going on in the app right now. So I'm going to get into, okay, the candle sale. So I'm going to plug my phone here. The two new candles, obviously available now. And then we got a whole bunch of other springtime tropical candles. So don't forget to get your Main Street Bakery your cherry blossom pound cake, and um, the Paris Cafe. I love Paris Cafe. That's a favorite of mine. I still have not burned cherry blossom pound cake. 
I don't know if I love this one on cold. We'll see what it's like burning. I'm going to try and get to this one this weekend because um, a lot of people are asking for reviews. But Main Street Bakery's the banana one. That is a total winner. Run, don't walk. Get that one. So that's a definite yes. Uh, that's the one with the banana in it. Oh, look. New Gingham Unstoppable. Boy, there's a lot going on in the app. I got to talk about that next. Gingham Unstoppable. Boy, they just released so much in the app today. Okay, we'll do another video about that. I also got a really exciting package from Judy. I'll roll the Gingham stuff with Judy's uh, package she sent me. You're, you guys are going to just love this. Okay, back to the candles. Um, let, me, let me get my candles on here. I just want to go through the list here so I know. Uh, Tropidelic. Uh, beautiful packaging. Not sure I love the scent. This is worth just like setting out because it's so pretty. The scent is just so intense. So it's pungent. That's what I keep calling it. The pungent scent. But um, look how pretty it looks. Sitting back here, put it next to uh, my beauty lush gate, uh, lush gate, lush, lush gateway, lush getaway. <laughs> the gateway to lush. <laughs> um, We've got your sweet carrot cake. My store was actually out of these. I don't know if they restocked, but um, sweet carrot cake's definitely one to get for that $12.95. Uh, let's see here. What else do we have? Oh, um, the, oh my gosh, you guys, you've got to get the Daffodil Daydreams. This one is amazing. It's the Marshmallow Floral. It's totally light, but it's so pretty and it's just really springy. I got to burn this one. I want to see how light it is burning, but um, I think it's really pretty. I love the packaging. Okay, so we got Daphne Daydreams. Um, we've got your White Barns, like Champagne Toast. Um, let's see here. Your Tropicals. I kind of stopped short of buying more Tropicals. I usually don't go overboard on my Tropicals. My favorite Tropical that I've gotten this year is that um, Sunset in Maui. I love this one. I gotta say, this is the um, sun-kissed papaya, hibiscus flowers, and ripe pineapple. It smells good. Very fruity. I'll burn some of these in the summer. I also got um, sweet kiwi and star fruit. This is the body care. Another really good one if you like fruit. Um, these are kind of like these super fruity candles. I'm going to start piling these back up here so I don't... Uh, Get confused. Sweet pea, I think, is still available in the store. Wait, is it? I don't know. Maybe it isn't. I'm going to have to look on that. I might be wrong on that. Um, I forgot I had coconut pina colada. I, this is one on my review list. It smells really good cold. It's coconut milk, blended pineapple, and a splash of rum. This one, I think, could be one of my favorites. I'm keeping that out because I really want to review that one. Um, your strawberry daiquiri your Tiki Beach. So these are your tropical candles. A lot of people like to save uh, tropical for summer. Um, hibiscus waterfalls. It's kind of funny because when you live in Northeast Ohio, you're not really thinking about tropical as much, you know, in February, March. But then, you know, when summer rolls around, you're kind of like, yeah, I wish I could burn a tropical candle. So that's why a lot of people pick them up uh, during the sale. So we've also got um, the spring collection, which is... The fresh cut violet, fresh cut violets. What am I talking about? Fresh cut lilacs. I saw purple. I'm like violet. Um, this is a must have. Oh my gosh, for spring, it's gonna make you think about spring. Even if you don't burn it, set it on your desk. Do this, and you'll get a little bit of scent off of it, or put it on a warmer. I gotta actually do um a warmer video. A lot of people ask me if I use a warmer. I do occasionally. I want to start using a warmer a little bit more. So we're going to explore some warmers. So that's going to be fun. So um, that's the fresh cut lilacs. Uh, we've got the um, the Black History Month candles, which were wonderful. We have got the, um, oh, butterfly. Where did I put my butterfly? I thought I had a butterfly sitting here. Um, oh, here it is. It's behind me. I got to review this one too, you guys. The jar on this is absolutely gorgeous. I think it smells good. Um, this is the raspberry nectar, iris petals, and airy vanilla. I usually don't like burning too florally candles in the house, but I think I'm going to actually like that one. Um, I actually never burned it as a candle. You know I love it as the body care. Uh, hummingbird tea cake, if you like the foodie scents. It's a wonderful pineapple. 
Love the jar. It looks like a Japanese lantern. Um, oh, the other one in that collection is uh, Backyard Honeysuckle. This is a little intense. Very floral, very honeysuckle. But again, I like the jar. I'll burn that probably, you know, during the summer. Um, let's see, what else do we have? Uh, beach weather. Oh, book loft. Book loft. <laughs> no, not book loft. Okay. Uh, let's see. Um, eucalyptus rain. Uh, this whole collection, I actually like spring clothesline. I highly recommend picking this up. You know me, I don't like linens, I don't like cottons, but for some reason this is delicious because it's got lemon water. Lemon water, dry, cinderad blossoms, and golden amber. This is a good one for spring and summer. I cannot get enough of this smell. It's beautiful as a lemon candle. So that's, a, that's one that I really do like. Um, fresh bamboo. I didn't even get fresh bamboo. Island margarita, warm ocean breeze. These are kind of like eh, candles. I did love fresh Amalfi lemon. So two lemon candles. If you love lemon, spring clothesline and fresh Amalfi lemon are two that I think you should put on your list. I don't know if the, is the bubble gum or the root beer still available online or in store. Maybe. Um, bubble gum was super light. I love the root beer one. Yeah, this is so light. Uh, root beer float was amazing. And then we go back. We still have some of the early candles like Palo Santo and Sage, Mahogany Vanilla. Um, let me see here. Oh, Calypso Clementine. I have one of those back here. Um, Bergamot and Birch. Uh, the Lavender Vetiver Greenhouse, um, oh, this one is really good. What was this called? It was called, uh, Greenhouse Fern. These are so pretty. Now that we're starting to get into spring here in Northeast Ohio, I want to start burning, uh, some of these a little bit more because they're pretty and, um, I like all those scents. Those are really nice. Oh yeah. My spring, spring, spring clothesline. Uh, Gwen's Notes, Anna's Garden. Um, let's see here. Then we go back even further. We've got like Endless Weekend in here. We've got uh, wild, a wild berry jam donut. Get your wild berry jam donut before it's gone because you're going to want that if you can't. If you, that's what, I didn't even remember it. That's a good one. Um, pineapple Mango. Um, wait, everyone's trying to get a hold of me now. My phone is beeping. <laughs> trying to get a hold of me um blue vetiver and lime cardamom and vetiver sweet red mango prosecco and peaches um a thousand wishes japanese cherry blossom into the night like it goes back pretty far if you look at like page three. Oh, look at the love candle is still on here i don't like bubbly rose um let's see here Sugar lemon zest, all of your white barns, your vanilla bean, your strawberry pound cake. So anyway, there's a lot of candles. Bath and Body Works is saying 85. That's a lot. This is definitely a hugely good deal, especially if you're using a coupon. Um, you, you know, $12.95 with the coupon, you can get into the 11 or even $9 range on candles. So let me know what you're shopping for today. Are you getting number 33 and number 42? They're on the way. I'm going to review those as soon as they get here. And um, I will be back. We got a lot to talk about later. Bye-bye.